Hello. Okay. A very good good evening, all of you, who are attending this uh, session since this afternoon. So I believe uh, you guys have uh, got a clarity about what is data science, what is business analytics, what is big data, and what is AI, what is deep learning, what is machine learning, different terminologies. I believe, as we have given a kind of uh, a uh, 10,000 feet view or a 360 degree idea about these receptive technologies. And some of you, as I can see, would be asking about the program details. So I'm Ratin Joshi, and I'll walk you through with the programs we have talked about in our earlier session that had happened. So about the programs we offer. So with Aegis and IBM, as we have talked earlier, we have joined hands with IBM for uh, delivering the courses in those disruptive technologies. And we have, <coughs> initiated uh, and set up IBM's, Aegis IBM Business Analytics, uh, Cyber Security and Cloud Computing Lab, uh, which is a virtual and physical lab setup we have, which participants and the working professionals, they use it for doing, uh, for the enhancement of their skills in those areas. Moving on to the next slide. So uh, we have rolled out the programs in association with IBM. So the first program we have rolled out uh, four years back, that is postgraduate program in Data Science, Business Analytics, and Big Data, which we offer, as I said earlier, in association with IBM. That program is also equivalent to MS in Data Science. Another program at the same go we have uh, launched, that is postgraduate program in graduate program in applied AI, machine learning, and deep learning. All right. So without uh, taking or uh, doing much ado, let me quickly start up with the info session for the program we offer, which is India's best postgraduate program in data science, business analytics, and big data, which we offer in request, the inquiries about the participant that which institution they should choose and which program they should opt for. So I'll be mentioning the 10 points which one should consider before opting any program, if anybody would be looking forward to uh, enhance their skills in any program or in any anything as we have already taken, industry association, we have already talked about, course content I'll be talking, I'll be walking you through. I'll also give you the insights about the faculty and the experts delivering the session. I'll also talk about the center of innovation. We'll talk about uh, the placements and the internship that the integrated system we have, career management center, who facilitate the participants for the internship and placements. We'll talk about the real life uh, project that already be, uh, already has uh, that has been discussed, I believe. So I'll be skipping that slide. Uh, we'll talk about the learning management system, which is an M University platform, end to end delivery platform we have. Uh, and the different benefits of the learning management system to the participants. Uh, we'll talk about the MUNI campus, which is a mobile application. Participants, they can take the entire session on the, on the go, on the fly, that kind of ease that system provides. You can take the entire session on your pocket. Uh, we'll talk about the treatment you guys are doing, right? So you'll be putting up, you'll be investing upon your career. It's a career investment you guys are doing. So if you're putting up your hard-earned money, if you're putting up that much of effort, time, and money as well, at the end of the day, you have to look at certain points before choosing, before this. This will play a major role, right? So you have to look at what sort of association an institution would have. Because this will provide the exposure to the participants, so the latest consider is the course curriculum. This will, this plays a major, major role because the course content, the curriculum will plays a major role in terms of shaping up your career. One also have to look at the faculties because you cannot expect a uh, management faculty or a computer science faculty, it doesn't matter how brilliant these faculties are, or the masters of their own uh, area, but they cannot deliver the entire hands-on. You need somebody who hails from the similar background, who have created the kind of platforms, who have built the systems using those disruptive technologies like AI, machine learning, deep learning, R, Python, these are skills, right? Then only you will get the real flavor and you get the entire exposure on these technologies. You need those experts. Another point one has to consider is the internship and placements, the live project, sorry. So learning is one thing, but it is not complete if somebody is not working upon the real life project, right? Because real life projects will participants the entire hands on, and the participants, they get their hands dirty with the technology which is required. And the participants become industry ready. Another option you have to look at, Another point one has to look at is the internship and placements. If, as I earlier told you, that if somebody would be spending the time, money, and effort to this program, one has to look at 
whether the institution point is plays a very vital role the learning management system uh, so today we you, you guys get exposed to these technologies though you have got a 360 degree view about the technology most of you might be aware about what is data science what is business analytics and kind of stuff over you might have got but if anybody would be getting a deeper dive into those technologies so believe me one session is not enough right so you have to have a system embedded there a platform which can record the entire session through which you can get the entire exposure about the technologies which is very 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 much required right so learning management system plays a very very vital role in order to enhance your learning curve labs labs plays a very 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 vital role right because you need a system where you can work upon the real life project and there should be a flexibility and ease of virtual and physical if you're on the campus you should have the physical lab presence and if you and there should be virtual lab sort of which participant they can use at any time on the fly on the go anywhere right for doing the live projects and consulting assignments delivery models and the patterns somebody of you are working i believe right somebody of you are fresher so there should be a system the institution should provide the kind of flexibility depending upon the kind of learning uh, the feasibility in order to opt the programs you should look forward to whether the institution has kind of full time or executive programs or not location plays a very important role you cannot expect the kind of delivery the kind of ecosystem the kind of exposure the participants they will get if any program is being delivered in bihar or any the area is seeding up that data science is seeding up and nurturing another point is the financial aid somebody of you like uh, kp had asked help the participants in terms of getting or providing them the assistance in terms of the loan and the financial assistance by providing them with the loan and this scholarship as well what we do also provide i'll be walking you through on the next slides okay i'll skip that slide who we are we have already talked about collaboration we have the collaboration with nvidia and ibm as we have already talked about okay let's come back to the main program what we have discussed okay so we have been recognized by ibm in uh, the areas of uh, for building the capabilities the capacities uh, bridging the gap in data science uh, with those technologies for the student and working professionals okay uh, the program we offer he is dr usma fayad he is one of the keynote speaker in our data science congress he is the ceo of open insight and he is the first chief data scientist titled ever their company open insight they have uh, hired the participants for this program and he himself quote that uh, this program is a good program and their organization they have already hired a uh, few of the participants uh, for the organization set up uh, by in collaboration with ages and ibm ibm business analytics cloud computing and cyber security lab that was unveiled by ms milita mayor she is an enterprise software and licensing working with ibm itself this is the sample certification participants they will get once they complete uh, the session from ages that will be jointly offered by ages and ibm here is the uh, the collaboration we had uh, with nvidia uh, and deep learning and ai they are experts they will come and they will deliver the sessions on ai and deep learning which is a part of the core course another certification that would be jointly offered by ages and nvidia deep learning institute uh, once the participants they can complete the deep learning and ai uh, program with ages okay now let's come back to the core courses so the science role and we have taken the inputs from the leading data scientists around the globe who helped us in designing the curriculum so the curriculum we have is a uh, combination of core courses and elective i'll just walk you through with the curriculum we offer we start everything from the scratch and the major vital element of any analytics program and data science program which is the statistics and probability then uh, we go to the advanced statistics parallelly will cover r language python is very much there as a core part of the course machine learning is there different types of machine learning like what we have discussed earlier machine learning for the smaller data set larger data set uh, for the uh, we offer uh, okay now there are since as i have discussed we offer this program in association with ibm there are certain ibm specific platforms and the tools which is widely being used by the system integrators of ibm and there are companies who are majorly working those uh, tools i'll just walk you through with those tools Uh, like uh, cognos bi which is a business intelligence based tool of ibm uh, Cog ibm um, cognitive computing by ibm ibm watson analytics ibm spss uh, infosphere big insight and there are many other uh, tools what would be delivered by the ibm experts i'll be walking you through in the next slide 
uh, okay okay now there are electives so these are the core courses that i have discussed with you guys another will be the elective courses uh, so there are bunch of electives available which participants they can choose as per their area of interest like scala quick sense SAS is there, Tableau is there, which is more of a glorified Excel sheet used to create the visualization, click sense, click view, uh, social media analytics. It's not working. Okay, uh, SQL is there, then Apache Fume is there, uh, HR analytics, IoT. These are the uh, different predictive analytics, pattern recognition. So these are the uh, electives available. Bunch of electives are available, which participants they can use it as per their area of interest and now since we know the world better so the project mentors the industry experts they will do the hand holding for the participant that which tool or which course will be beneficial for them next slide so here are some of the ibm experts who will come and deliver the session to the participants like our ibm specific uh, individuals who come and deliver the session now coming to the main faculties and mentors so the entire program will be delivered by best of the data scientists around the globe and most of the faculties uh, they hail from a similar background, hey, they hail from the PhD background, from the similar disruptive technologies that we have talked about. I'll just uh, give some of the uh, snapshot of the faculties. Dr. Vinay Kulkarni, he is the director of AGES and the faculty for a status founder and founding dean of uh, IAM Endor, and also the founder and dean director of uh, Tata Institute of Social Science. He takes care of the HR analytics and uh, the uh, critical thinking at ages. Dr. Modaliti, he is the faculty for statistics and probability. He is uh, awarded as a best faculty in the entire Asia Pacific for the statistics and operation analytics. Uh, Dr. Malesh, he is the faculty for machine learning. He is the faculty for Hadoop. He hails from the similar BTEC from IIT Bombay and MS in computer science from NYU. Uh, Dr. Suresh, we have on board. He is the faculty for Python and natural language processing at ages. We have uh, Mukundan Srinivasan. He's an NVIDIA expert, solution architect with, uh, <coughs> she has a PhD in NLP from IIT Bombay itself. Dr. Shamshuddin we have, uh, Dr. Shamshuddin, he is an adjunct professor uh, for machine learning. He holds dual uh, PhD from IIT Bombay and Monash University in computer science. Uh, we have Dr. Umesh with us, he's the faculty for the statistics. Dr. Elija, that guy, he's a Russian data scientist, takes care of the natural language processing and information retrieval at ages. We have on board Dr. Srinivas Polison. He's an adjunct professor for data science and deep learning and also uh, the uh, data mining. Uh, earlier he was working as a research associate with Harvard University. Uh, Mr. Bhupesh Dahiria, he is the CEO of Ages, takes care of the use case of big data with Ages. Dr. Abbas Ali, he is a faculty for uh, foundation of data science. He is a real-time data scientist working with IBM. Uh, we have Mukesh Jain, he's a CTO of VFS Global Faculty for Business Analytics. Uh, so these are the faculties. <clears throat> now as we have discussed earlier, we have also launched uh, last month <clears throat> the applied PGP and applied AI machine learning and deep learning program, which we offer in association with IBM. I'll quickly walk you through with a snapshot of this program as well. So the participants, they will get the access to NVIDIA proprietary technologies and software, self-driving cars, image classification, chatbots, to and to determine the best approaches to diagnose the cancers, right? And also natural language processing, speech recognition, extra. Participants who will join such these programs, they will also have the access for AWS course material on AI, machine learning, deep learning, and also they will have the access for uh, the AWS cloud computing, uh, cloud lab for developing the AI uh, applications like chatbot, job recommender system that we, we have seen earlier, image recognition system, etc. This is the sample certification participants they will get once they complete uh, the program that will be jointly offered and delivered by IBM and AGES. Core courses, deep learning with TensorFlow, what, which is a very core part of the course. Cognitive computing by IBM is a core part of the course. Robotics, computer vision, speech recognition, math foundation for AI, cyber security, graph database, machine learning, SQL, neural networks, Tableau, big data which Apache Spark, pattern recognition, Hadoop, predictive analytics. So there are a bunch of electives available which participants they can choose as per their area of interest. And as I have ta already talked, since uh, we know where the world is moving, right? So the uh, project mentors, the industry experts, they will do the hand holding for the participants. And they will update that which tool will be more beneficial for them. And depending upon the project's requirement as well. We already talked about the Data Science Congress, the largest 
conference we host, one of the largest Asia's, one of the largest event what we do host, that is the just Gramble Award. Uh, hackathons, we keep uh, conducting certain hackathons, workshops on these technologies through which participants, they get the exposure, what is happening in those disruptive technologies, career management center, right? So that career management center plays a very, very, very vital role. It's one of the most integrated part of AGIS, the program we offer. So the major lookout of this career management center is to facilitate the participants with the tremendous, uh, excellent opportunities in terms of the internship and placements. Right, some of the recruiters that we have talked earlier, but I'll just walk you through again. Uh, for the last batch, if I talk about the statistics wise, we have, uh, we have come and observe Deloitte, who was our knowledge partner, Fractal, which is a big, big name in data science domain, uh, Cuddle AI, uh, Accenture, ENY, Ernest & Your Location, Angel Broking, l and Infotech, l and Finance, uh, Suzlon, and there are many, many other companies, right? So the minimum package, what <coughs> maximum that goes up to 12.5 for the fresher. And individuals who have typically, say, uh, six or seven years of experience, so companies, they have offered them a hike of 50 to 100 percent. Now, education background, uh, the different background participants they come from. So anybody we have already talked about, <coughs> the participants, they come from different background, right? So anybody is eligible to apply for this course if anybody had studied mathematics, who somebody who hails from a mathematics background, statistics background, uh, commerce background, economics background, management graduates. So participants, they hail from different backgrounds, VTech graduates, any stream, right? So one should have studied mathematics, and one should have that much of logical and analytical reasoning capabilities. And at the end, right, things are getting automated now. So if you want to make your career into the fastest growing and highest remunerating field, this is the area you have to look at. Right? So this is the statistics I have shown you. OK, the Aegis Big Data Product Factory. This we have already talked about. This is one of the major, major USP of the program through which participants, they get the entire exposure on the tools and the uh, techniques, what I have just walked you through. Uh, so this plays a very, very vital role, a major USP of the program, which helps the participants and make the participants industry ready. Caption project, we also uh, force the participants to come up with a data science product, right? So during the entire tenure of the program, participants, they come up with brilliant projects and the products, the projects they have done so far, like predictive in uh, flight delay, uh, cricket match outcome production, application for machine learning for a stock market, interactive stock ride, dynamic pricing for airlines industry, brilliant other projects participants they have done, AI based story uh, telling software. You have to click the photograph, upload it to the system, and you just set the genre, right? Which, which kind of story you will look forward to here from the system. So the AI, it will analyze the objects, analyze the picture, and give you the kind of entire story. Brilliant project participants they have done. So these are the projects which actually helping the participants and help the participants to, as I said earlier, to make to make themselves like industry ready, right? And and this is what companies are looking at at the end of the day, right? So this helps the participants to uh, make their career to get observed by the companies very easily because this is what companies they are looking at. MU University platform, right? Which is an end-to-end -end delivery platform. We have state-of-the-art learning management system. What we use. So we use that platform, which is called MUNI, M University. It's a learning management system. Some of the benefits of that learning management system, so participants, they will have the access to tons of the recorded session, current and previous lectures. Uh, there are tons of uh, repository of the e-books, business uh, cases, case studies, reference material which participants they can use anytime, on the fly, on the go. Access to their overall performances, participants, they can see their grade, their attendance, their marks obtained, and their evaluation by using that platform. Participants, they will have the flexibility to upload the assignments like quizzes, tests, etc., cetera, or by, by using that platform. Uh, it also provides the flexibility uh, to go through mobile friendly. So participants, they don't need to uh, open the laptop for using that LMS. They can access the entire LMS on their mobile phone. Uh, this will also showcase the participants' performance, and this will also help for the faculties to evaluate the participants if suppose some group is not functioning well or not performing well, they have the clarity that in which group they have focused more, and this improves the overall performance of the participants. So I'll just, I have mentioned some of the live lectures by Dr. Vinay Kulkarni. I'll walk you through how this M University platform looks like. I have taken the screenshot. So this is how the LMS system looks like. 
and we use that system to deliver our session on uh, to around the globe. Uh, so participants, they can access these sessions online, interactive basis, we use that LMS system only for delivering that session around the globe. So he is Mr. Uh, Dr. Vinay Kulkarni, he is the director of ages, taking care of the session on big data analytics with Hadoop, this is how the platform looks like. Uh, Mr. Cyrus Linton, he is the faculty for visualization at ages, uh, taking sessions on business intelligence and visualization. So the entire session will be recorded and uploaded to the learning management system, which participants they can review it, revive it, and watch it anytime, anywhere, on the fly, on the go. He is uh, Tejas Sangvi uh, from Fractal Guy. He is taking sessions on machine learning techniques to solve the business problems. <coughs> okay, now I have discussed earlier in Unicampus, right? So all of you might be using your Android phone you have, right? So you can download the application from the Android Play Store, and this is how the application looks like. I have captured the screenshot of that uh, application. This is how the dashboard looks like. You can see the courses you have registered for. You can also look forward for the uh, live sessions which are going on. You can see the placement statistics. You can look forward to the scheduling part. You can see the events going on, the attendance, the marks obtained, everything. Suppose I, I have registered myself for a few of the courses. So if I click, I can see the live lectures, as I said, which is going on. So you participant, they have the access for the same. One can look at uh, the, so this is how the courses, if you just click on the courses you have registered for, so participants, they will have a one window view, the dashboard, the first image I have uh, mentioned here, these are the courses I have registered myself, like statistics and probability deep learning with TensorFlow, uh, uh, big data analytics with Excel, statistics and probability, R language, NLP, so you can have the entire uh, details on your screen. If you click on, suppose I have clicked on a statistics and probability, I'll, you can see the overview, the content, the video, the instructor's details in one page. This is how the UI looks like. You will see, uh, if you click on the video part, you will see the video will come up, and this is how it will appear on your screen. And you will also see the faculties on your screen itself. If you click on the instructor's part, Dr. Vinay Kulkarni, Dr. Uh, Umesh, you can see the faculties, the details. Suppose you want to revive this session, you want to watch this session, click on that video link which is mentioned here. This is how the video will start playing on your screen. I have taken this screenshot in a vertical way. If you just tilt your screen uh, in a landscape mode, the clarity will be very, very, very brilliant. So this is how the M University looks and works like. Okay, coming to the delivery models. So. Uh, as I have discussed in the beginning that there are different delivery models for this program. So I'll just walk you through the first delivery model, which is a full-time on-campus program, which is a post-graduate program in data science, business analytics, and big data. Duration will be 11 months, in which the classes will be held six days a week. And uh, there will be, uh, and once the completion of the course, there will be two to three months of internship. And that internship will be a paid internship in which participants, they will get this stipend, right? And the total program structure will be of 45 credit unit. Commencement date, we are commencing the full-time program for the data science I discussed in the beginning on 18th September. And we are conducting the uh, applied AI program from 29th October in Mumbai. Another delivery models we have, which is for the working professional, if anybody would have, say, minimum two years of experience is required. So uh, the first model I have mentioned here is a weekend on-campus program which is an executive postgraduate program in data science, business analytics, and big data, executive online, or uh, on-campus model. Duration will be the same, that is 11 months, with the nine months of training, that is followed by two to three months of capstone project. And then followed by the career assistance, for that we have a dedicated career management center who facilitate the participants, as I have discussed earlier, with the excellent uh, placements and the opportunities, right? Commencement date, Mumbai, we are starting the batch uh, for the data science program, 20th October. Uh, Pune, we are starting the data science program on 21st October. Bangalore, we are starting the data science program on 14th October. And the applied AI program, we are starting in Mumbai on 17th November. Pune, we are starting the applied AI program on 24th November. Bangalore, we are starting the applied AI program on 10th November 2018. Another model we have, so this is for cities, so they, I would recommend if anybody would be looking for to apply for these courses, you should look forward for the on-campus weekend program if anybody is working. 
But if somebody would be staying in the areas where we don't have any presence, right? So one can look forward for the another model, which is again an executive postgraduate program. It's an online live interactive weekend model. So uh, we deliver these online interactive session at present, 15 countries around the globe. Uh, it's a live interactive session, like the having the conversation we are having, though we are using the Google platform. But we deliver this uh, program through our M University, what I have just walked you through in the previous slides, in which the participants, they will have the access for the microphone, for the video, for the audio output. You can raise your queries to the faculties. Faculties, they can the experts, they can also see you. They can, uh, you know, they, can, they can help you with the remotely access on your system. This is how the platforms works. And the duration of the program will be 11 months. Classes will be held on Saturday, Sunday. It's a live interactive online session. Uh, timings, full day, 10 to 5, 10 to 6. After nine months of training, there will be two to three months of caption project, which is a core part of the course, commencing from 20th October. And uh, the AI program is commencing from 17th November. Uh, is the date, right? Now quickly I'll just uh, give you a brief that the yeah, process how to apply. So if anybody would be looking for to apply for this course, one has to fill the online application. Applications are open. Uh, once we receive the application for the full-time program and the weekend classroom training program, we conduct the class, the, the uh, personal round of interviews. And for the live interactive program, we conduct Skype interviews. It records and there are other parameters if somebody would hail from some aspiring leader working in this similar technology or any other different different technology and research or consulting under which we invite the applications from the individuals who hails from the PhD background, uh, PhD in mathematics, stat have tremendous academic records, excellent academic records. And if somebody would be working in somewhere in domain like, so there are so many parameters we gauge the participants. If we found somebody suitable, we disperse this scholarship, provide this scholarship. And again, I highlight a point that these scholarships we provide only for the full-time program, not for the executive models. Study loan, uh, so the financial assistance we have, we have the tie-up with HDF, the Cadilla, Evans, Advance, uh, Mintro Capital. So who disperse the education loan to the participants if anybody get through and shortlisted during the program? And apart from that, every major bank in India, they disperse list and whom we extend the admission offer for the program. Okay, if you guys want to get more update, if you guys want to get yourself updated on these disruptive technologies, again I'll mention, subscribe yourself at www.datasciencegyan.com, follow the page or Facebook, and you will be keep on updating with the different sources, the articles, the disruptions which is happening in the market. So that's all from my end. Thank you so much. I'm Ratan Joshi. If anybody would have any questions, I'm here. You can feel free to ask me any questions. Or you can capture the screenshot of the screen. You can reach out to us on the number. I have mentioned my colleague's number and their coordinates as well. You can write to us. If anybody would have any questions, I'm here. Please. So anybody would have any questions? Participants who are watching us live? Any questions you have, guys? Or we'll wrap up the entire session. Anybody else would have any questions? All right, guys, it's been pleasure connecting. Okay, okay, somebody's asking, okay, great. Is LMS available for iOS? We're building up uh, for the iOS as well. As of now, it's an Android-based application. You can use it from your laptop uh, or Android device, anywhere on the fly, on the go, Prasad. We have shared the link, the team who is handling the chats.
they have mentioned the links you will get to the more information on that all right great prasad so i believe uh, so we should wrap up now or if anybody would have any question please okay prasad so you have you can check the curriculum tab there are so many tabs available we have shared the links with you go through it you will get to know more information about the program brilliant guys so it's a wonderful talking to you and thank you for being such a nice audience great pleasure talking to you guys any queries if you have any you can reach out to us we have mentioned our number here in the screen or you can reach out you can write us uh, we'll be happy to help you with any kind of queries if you have any thank you all the very best thank you so much pleasure connecting guys